104.91. Back right here in Chuco Town, the Latin Comedy Jam, one of the hottest tours in the nation, is hitting El Paso's Plaza Theater on Friday night. Apart from providing loads of laughs to Borderland residents, the host of the show, Ernie G, is also taking the time to touch the lives of athletes and sports fans right here in El Paso. It's great. I want to come back to El Paso for like a week. From talking sports and his close friendship with Hank Gathers, the Loyola Marymount player that tragically died on the court in the 1990s. When Hank passed, it was the worst thing that ever happened to me. To inspiring young athletes at the Lower Valley's Carolina Rec Center, that education and success can be achieved no matter what obstacles you have stacked against you. And I listened to the troubles in the hood, I would have ended up dead or in jail. Ernie G winds down a typical Thursday, making an impression on the lives of at-risk youth. Ernie G hosts the Latin Comedy Jam, set to hit the Plaza Theater this Friday, but he's making a bigger name for himself as a nationally known empowerment speaker for students. He calls it edutainment. And it goes beyond serving as a positive role model to athletes here in the El Paso area. In fact, Ernie G this entire week has spoken to a number of students, including on Wednesday, right here at Eastwood High School, definitely making a difference in empowering the students of the Isleta Independent School District. I did it! He did it, and so did Josh Urrutia, a freshman baseball player at Eastwood, making a commitment to education. College is really important. Bro. Josh truly took in Ernie's empowerment exhibition eagerly and open-eyed. And it made me realize that going into college is really important to do that. I was in a bad place. After a rough day, Nicolas Alvarez was also inspired by the powerful words. You are meant to let your light shine. You really helped out. Thank you. No, thank you. A message also reiterated back from the clever comedian committed to making a change. Thank you for letting me let my light shine. And please continue to let your light shine. All right, you guys, thank you. One athlete at a time. The Carolina Rec Center, man. One student at a time. Right here along the board. Yeah, Latinos are coming up, man. Very true, my friend. That's it for now. I'm Paul Cicala for ABC7 Sports. We'll be right back.